Well, guys, it's currently um 1:08 a.m. right now, so I kind of have to be quiet. But um, hopefully, uh, you guys can still hear me. Ultimatum returned. Yeah, not a lot of people were expecting it as much this time, but as you guys can see, yep, it's in the lottery. And there are a lot of other weapons that also returned with it. For example, Laser Bow, another really popular one. Um, Gift Stealer, really popular. Um, Battle Falcon. Um, but we also have, like, a uh, Social Uzi. That's, I th in my opinion, stupid. Um, I, I can't believe they brought that back. And then we also have, like, Mystical Aura Emitter, which is kind of crazy. Um yeah it's back dude that's crazy man and obviously it's in the super chest so the odds of getting it are extremely rare rare my bad and um yeah you can get 2,000 keys for 20 bucks right now and dang dude i wish uh i wish i could get some keys right now to test to see how rigged it is but i have a feeling the odds of getting it are going to be extremely low but man that's crazy, dude. World War III is currently going on in the Discord server right now. Everyone's saying it has a 0.001% drop rate. That's every one in 1,000 weapon, or every one in 1,000 chests, which I don't know how they know that, but two people just sent the same message at the same time. So I don't know how they know that, but that's crazy dude yeah so they had to add a 45 minute cooldown and also disable image perms because yeah dude people are flooding this i mean look at this dude they're they're all flooding these weapons yeah look or the the chest i mean look at this it's crazy dude Ugh. i, I want to go look at general really quick let's see what general slow mode is um i'm curious oh one minute oh my gosh all right, well, I equipped some of the lottery weapons. Let's test them out, and um, yeah, I mean, I'm not gonna test all of them in this video, but we'll test out some of these main ones first, right now. So guys, some quick Q&A. Um, no, I don't know the drop rate for ultimatum. I mean, everyone was saying, or a couple people at least said um, one in 1,000, which I have a feeling that's not true. That seems like a bit uh, much, just to be honest. Um, Oh my gosh, one shot doesn't even one shot body shot anymore. Are you kidding me? Dude, they really need to buff one shot. Um, Ultimatum is not available in the gallery right now, so you can't exchange it with coupons. So you have to get it through the super chest, which uh, I guess kind of makes sense. But yeah, as you guys can see, Ultimatum, it's a pretty good shotgun. However, it's not as good as people think it is. Look at that. See, it's not, I mean, it's good, but it's, it's not as good as people make it out to be, okay? So yeah, don't spend hundreds of dollars to get this weapon it's not going to be that game changing i promise you that okay you know what weapons are game changing um golden bros uh golden friend um stormtrooper i don't know other weapons like that this weapon i mean especially if you miss a shot it's not like i mean right now okay don't blame me it's 1 a.m in the freaking morning like look at that that's a point blank range shot not not even a one shot dude so yeah people can uh People can, like, complain all they want, um, or be as happy as they want, but it's really, guys, not that game-changing, okay? But yeah, Sparkling Horn, pretty good for 3-cat, especially. Um, it's, it's basically just a better version of Thunderer and Exterminator, so, yeah, that's very good. Um, however, right now, none of my weapons are doing any damage. You know why? Because of Ultimate Defense Armor and Black Dragon Armor. Like, how are you not even what? How does it not one-shot headshot? Are you kidding me? That's so stupid. Um, yeah, I kind of hate that everyone now has OP armor, but also kind of like it at the same time. It kind of makes me want to use automatics more instead of, like, these three cat weapons. Um, Ice Paws are, of course, pretty dang good. I'm sure a lot of you guys know that. But with what's weird is with Ice Paws, you have to, like, do side attacks. And I really absolutely hate people that use the shield. Also, guys, all my modules are level 7, and I have no wear on. Um, if I, if I put wear on, then my weapons would probably start one-shotting, but yeah, right now, no wear on, so, yeah. Um, I personally don't like ice, ice paws, because they're just way too inconsistent. So, if you guys don't know, Gift Stealer is better than Vertical Grip Device, because, um, I mean, it, it doesn't have a higher fire rate, however, its grapple distance is way farther. Um, so, yeah, if you, if you want that question answered, there you go. Uh, Gift Stealer has a 
farther grapple grapple distance. Um, so slower fire rate, but it has more ammo. I'm pretty sure, and it has a longer grapple distance. So. Yeah, if you want to get Gift Stealer, definitely recommend doing it, and you can actually get kills with it if you have players like this that aren't that good. There you go. There's a kill with that. Event Horizon is decent. It will one-shot if you can do a direct body shot. However, the Plasma Rocket is very unreliable and will pretty much never get you kills, so you definitely want to hit that direct body shot, and this is definitely more of a tactical weapon that you want to use in, like, Team Strike or... Um, other game modes like that where you're going to be shooting like towards enemy sides um, but it will one shot body shot I think every time I don't actually know the damage on it but as you guys can see I mean that guy just spawned in he had taken no damage and I one shot him so yeah there you go also there's no way that people requested this they 100% just put that in there for fun no way people requested that all right, this is the next loadout we're going to test. Uh, we got Heart of Volcano, Bubblegum01, which in my opinion is the best sniper in this lottery. In fact, maybe even the best weapon. I don't know. Necklace of the Ice King. Um, we, there's not another melee to test, I'm pretty sure. Uh, but we got Pulling Sucker Gun, and we're also going to try Social Uzi. And don't worry, guys, this weapon is not good, okay? I can promise you that. All right, so Pulling Sucker Gun is obviously pretty good for just getting around, but that's pretty much it. Um, Heart of Volcano, I don't actually know how good this is. Mm, not that good, apparently. It's probably good for 3-cat. Um, you know, it's probably like destruction system, you know. But other than that, you know, it's, of course it's pretty mid. Uh, Necklace of the Ice King uh, was recently buffed, and I'm pretty sure it's now better than Poison Darts. So if you want a good no-delay weapon for 3-cat, definitely try to get Necklace of the Ice King. But yeah, as you guys can see, um, I guess this loadout together is really good um i don't actually know if bubblegum01 will one shot bots but i'm assuming it won't oh oh no yeah see it doesn't but what's really op about bubblegum01 is as you guys can see it throws down gum oh it didn't that time uh well it's supposed to throw down like an area of gum effect um which it's not doing what did they change it is it broken no way it's broken guys no way. Well, okay, what it's supposed to do is throw down an area of gum, like that gum gadget does, and then if people touch it, they get slowed down. But it looks like that's not happening. Also, guys, mine is at Mythical, um, so it might be a little bit better than it actually is for you guys, but yeah, it's whatever. Um, none of my weapons are doing good right now, so I don't know what's going on there. But yeah, this is a pretty good 3-cat loadout right here. Um, Heart of Volcano apparently is really good for 3-cat. There you go. I would probably even pick it over a destruction system because of it doesn't have like as low of a thing. You know how like the destruction system shoots out lower? Um, I, I don't think Heart of Volcano has that, but it might. Um, yeah, so next up we got Social Uzi. You guys, will, you guys will probably get this weapon on your own and you guys will see for yourself it's not that good. You can definitely trust me on that. Um, I mean, I have the energy module combo, so I can do increased damage, but look at that. Look at how long it takes to kill a bot. So you really think it's going to be good against players? I mean, I'm getting kills, but yeah, look at that. That that got around to 43%. Um, so yeah, that's kind of annoying, um, and I don't think you can upgrade this. Uh, yeah, as you guys can see, it's just stuck at common, which is kind of annoying, but yeah, these other weapons are pretty dang good. All right, guys, I'm ending the video there. Time to go cry myself to sleep. Good night.